Look at that chin action. Yeah, you have anything in the fridge for me? What? What is that? Is that full fat milk? 100% flux. Momo, you have some good taste. What else is in here? What else is Mo- Can Momo drink stuff? What is that? Like Pepto-Bismol, Momo? Welcome back to Stray. It's been a hot second since we played this game. I'm curious to see how it's gonna end. If you haven't watched the first part, go watch it. And let's finish the game. Let's see where this story goes. So last time we were here, we helped Momo fix the transceiver. To get to the surface, we have to get to that tower over there. Momo was one of the outsiders. He didn't go with his friends. He was left behind and then he was sad and we helped him become unsad. What was that? What? M Momo, why did you- why did you lock me out? What? I- Oh god, I have to remember how to play this game. Wait a second, bucket. Oh, right, we get to ride in buckets. I mean, who needs taxis and buses? It's been so long since I've played this game, and I've been so curious to see what the story is. Last time I was speculating if maybe humans had left this area. Uh, we have entered the rooftops area. <laughs> the music is, uh, uh interesting. Oh, 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 I didn't miss them. I just give me a sec, y'all. I just need to like get prepared. Oh man, the music reflects what I'm feeling inside perfectly, which is yo gross. The graphics of this game as well still baffle me. Like it's just beautiful. Oh no, wait, wait, wait. I'm talking about the graphics. Oh gee, Jesus. I have to I have to press B to attract enemies? Don't I not want to attract enemies game? Oh god, I'm gonna die. Well, that's a good start to the game, isn't it? Uh, know what to do now. Just have to remember what buttons to press. Can you blame me? Ugh! Get out of my face. I got the controller under my desk, and I'm not like a... I don't remember controls very well, so please. You can't blame me, okay? That's my excuse. Who left all this trash here? Haven't they heard of recycling? What was that? What is this? Is this pizza? Remember? Oh, a memory. That's right, B12. Our little friend has memories to remember. What's the memory? You went to a pizza parlor. There used to be strict energy caps, especially in the slums. But people couldn't handle the constant darkness. One day someone lit up rainbow lamps, neon signs all over their house. That person was taken away and never seen again. So they de definitely living in, in, in a society where neon lights and uh, free will was not acceptable. But people saw hope and not long after everyone started putting lots of lights in their homes, there was nothing. The Oppressors could do. Ooh. Rebellion. Rebellion in the way of these beautiful neon lights. This is such a big part of why, like, Stray is such a beautiful game. It's just that lighting. So intense. Oh, new memory. We've got a heck ton of memories to remember. My Mac is having, like, a heck of a time loading these areas, so I'm so sorry for the laggy video. I think we're supposed to be over there. Maybe if we land from here? There we go. Beautiful. What to do here? I think we can go inside of these. Have you ever seen a more efficient barrel? A dollar sign? Oh, now you're speaking my language. Pizza and money. It's all I've ever wanted. Money to buy pizza. Pineapple pizza, everyone. Because pineapple on pizza? I'm looking for a fight. They know I'm looking for a fight. Pineapple on pizza is uh, delicious. Don't talk to me. <laughs> B12, are you sure we want to hack the door to those? Have you seen what I'm like with controls? I'm gonna run. See you later. See you later. See you later. Oh, sh I'm gonna die. Oh, oh, oh God. Oh, oh, God. There we go. Beautiful. Don't move. I gotta use you for something. I mean, gross. You guys need a cleaning service here. We're saving and uh, we're seeing things we don't want to see. Something common. We'll push that. Feet of power. Plank of accomplishment. Place of grossness. OSRT88 oil. And a lot of socks. Folks needed a lot of socks back in the day. Hi, everybody. Jesus Christ. Where are we supposed to go? There's places to be and I'm not in them. Oh, there we go. <gasps> oh, this isn't feel goodsy, I'll tell you that much. A memory. Here, B12, what a lovely place to have a memory. Necocorp, as trash from the upper levels overloaded the slums, they tried to develop a bacteria to dissolve it all. Let me guess, that's what the Zerks are. After the humans disappeared, that bacteria mutated, growing, eating away more than trash. And now we have Zerks. Great. What what a lovely story. Zerks aren't even like a, you know, a biologically natural thing. But nothing is in this world. It's all scary. And created by humans. Let's go. I will try. Oh, we could have gone back here this whole time. I think I need to trap them in here. All right, you go do that, B12. I'm gonna run this way and uh, I'm gonna lock them. Oh man, I know what we need to do. Yeah, I did die nine times. Thank you. We're supposed to... Push the barrel through there? Okay, I guess this is what we're supposed to do. Oh my god, okay, we're doing it! We're doing it! Holy sh**, that part was horrible! There's more. 
See you later, suckers. Well, we're making it up top, but it sure is uh, unpleasant over here. What is that, a, le a lever? That's a lever, everybody. If I was called bread here, I'd be happy to pull this lever. Well, we made that happen. Suppose we have to ride that. But why are there so many of them? Oh my god, 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 oh my god. I'm dying! I knew it. Best player of Stray ever. I just, I'm such a mastermind. All right, we can go in, right? Please let me in, let, let me in. Oh, okay. Oh, it's a good thing this cat has uh, more than nine lives, because, jeez Louise. Losers, all of you. Goodbye. Thank you, elevator. For not f***ing working. Do you have to make me go up the cat way? All right, sure. We're gonna use an item. The transceiver? Because it's definitely not the energy drink. I think. Oh, dude. Fits like a glove. Oh. So the tower, it's like lighting up the tower? There's like a radio signal, sorry. See, it's interesting that the neon lights were like the rebellion, you know, or the voice against oppression. And it's such a big part of what makes this game so beautiful visually. There's all those colors in neon lights. Please tell me things are more peaceful. I see a bucket. Humankind built this shell to protect themselves from the outside, but it came at a cost. Nobody can go out. Judging by everything, it looks like humans tried to... Uh, something happened on the surface and they tried to take shelter here, but uh, definitely sh hit the fan, so... The outside was a disaster. Completely barren, unlivable, and dangerous. Is this like a because humans are destroying the earth thing? But if you come from there, it must mean it's safe again. Oh, so B12's promise was to open the city. All right, let's go find Momo. Momo, are you here? It's the slums part two. Look, a note. I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of their antenna. Come meet me there. I've Lock the window, but the code to open it is quite simple. It is super califragile. Jesus, it's not far from that. Error, wrong key. Whoops, my bad. Okay, let's try that again. Uh, B12 is typing in the wrong numbers. Oh, okay, there we go. Who's Mito? Hello? I love the weather right now. I don't know whether or not I should believe you, Mito. Oh, the Guardian is here. You look lost. What do you need? I want to know where you got your sick moves. Oh, maybe that's the bar. Oh, it is the bar. We made it. Hi, Momo. Oh, my God. Oh, that's so cute the way he's waving. I love you, Momo. Hey, little furball. I managed to get a signal. Perfect. Best news of the day because I died like 10 times. Who's in here? Hi, everyone. What a lovely place this is. Why is the, the, the little actions he has are so sweet? Momo, you're a blessing to this weird dystopian world. Cutscene. I just got a pat. Okay, the whole Zerks thing was worth it just for that. Momo, you're my best friend. I hope we get to go to the surface together. And you can meet my cat family. Oh, okay, so the blue text is like what we're receiving through the transceiver? Hello, can anyone hear me? Hello, yes, we can hear you. We are from the slums. We're looking for a way out and... Wait, is that you, Zabaltazar? Are his friends alive? It is him. Oh. I I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice, Zabaltazar. Where are you? Are the others okay? Yes, we are safe. We found a way up. You have to go through the sewers to reach us. Darn it, we've lost the signal. God damn it, Momo. The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums. But if Zabaltazar made it, there must be a way. What now, Momo? Please help. Who is that? In the vest, hi. Are you invested in this story too, Seamus? You'll never get past the sewers. It's infested with Zerks. Made in France? Hello, we got some French produce here. Is, is there some cheese in there? Un peu de fromage, s'il vous plaît? Anyway, I warned you, your business is none of my business. Is it? It It's not your business. Is that why you came into this conversation? Seamus? You seem as though you do care. His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test the device and never came back. Seamus has never been the same since. Ah, uh, so we get why Seamus is that way. What do we do now, Momo? Don't listen to Seamus. He's just scared like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. We need to find it? Come on, follow me. Oh, I can follow you. We're going to Seamus's apartment together? Makes me so happy, Momo. You have no idea. Come on, Seamus. Open the door. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me. But you... I think I have an idea. What's your idea consist of? Safe things? You want me to sneak in, don't you? I knew it. 
I get to go into the little hole. Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. Perfect. Uh, hi. Hello, Seamus. This might seem as though I broke into your house, but I promise it's uh, for a good reason. I promise this is, uh, this is not the same pun twice. Don't worry, Seamus. Oh, wait a second. We gotta show him the item. What am I doing? Wait. Is this my papa's? There's a secret room here in our flat, but where? Oh, I can find it. I, I think we're gonna slap stuff off the wall, Seamus. Don't mind me. You just came here to be a little rude. Time will tell. Ti time will tell what? I need more behind this. Oh, use digicode. What digicode? We evidently need to find the code first. Oh, I see that. You crafty buggers. Is it where the small hand is on the clock? Am I smart? Is this good? So smart, intelligent. This cat is beyond any form of intelligence you've ever seen, Seamus. Let's go. I've never seen this room. I can't believe he managed to hide it from me all this time. And the answer was right over your head, buddy. And all those clocks. You should have clocked in on that. Seamus is gonna Seamus is gonna hate me by the end of this. I think we can talk with Seamus again. What do you think, Seamus? Find anything interesting in here? Oh, we're supposed to find an object. I got you, Seamus. Maybe this box has something. Oh, it definitely has. What is that? Take broken tracker. Yeah, sure. Don't mind me. It's mine now, dingus. Give it to me. Seamus, you suck at looking around the room. I mean, you didn't touch anything in your apartment. Yes, I want to show you something. Wait up. Wait, I remember that. That's his tracker. Papa always used that tracker to keep an eye on where I was. Maybe we can reverse it to find where he went. I hope everybody's alive. All these folks that went missing. You need a weapon for the Zerks, right? My papa definitely took one with him. We just need to repair the tracker so we can find him. Someone in the slums should be able to help. Come with me, I'll open the door for you. Are we gonna go see Momo, my favorite robot of all time? Thank you, Seamus. Catch you later, buddy. Uh, Momo, there's an upstairs, buddy? Surely we can do something here. Oh yeah, baby. Hole in... Wait. Almost hole in one. I promise I'm good at pool. Look at that. What did I say? You ever doubt me again? I'll be angry. About <laughs> nothing. Let's go talk to Momo. Did you find anything interesting at Seamus's? Interesting device, but it looks broken. Maybe someone in the village can help you repair it. Momo, it wasn't you? Uh, hi. I know a guy who fixes stuff like this. Oh, his name's Elliot. His office is just left of here near grandma's shop. There's a grandma and she has a shop? Left of here? You think I know my directions? I'm a cat, Jacob. What is that? What is all of this? Well, I know what this is. Oh, let me in. Hi, who's in here? Who is that? I, that was a complete accident. What, what? What is this? Uh, hello? I, I'm not able to talk to you. What is this? We were programmed to be slaves, but since... However many days that is. <laughs> we have a soul. Hope one day the outsiders will find the exit of this hell. Momo. Oh dear lordy, human beings are up to shenanigans again, and that's putting it lightly. Oh, now we can meet him. You're here for Elliot, he's just over there. Oh, we're in the right spot. Oh, I hear some good music. Elliot has good taste. There's a memory here. Oh, there he is. It looks like he's up to something. Something productive. But uh, let's see. There's this other productive thing to do. It's remarkable that human ingenuity found a way to create plants that thrive without sunlight. Ooh. Elliot? Hi, buddy. Oh, wow. That's a great tracker. I recognize this model. You can track anyone with this little gadget. May I? Uh, that's why I'm here, Elliot. It's all yours. I know how to repair it, but when I'm trembling like this, I can't use my keyboard. I think I need a blanket to be able to fix your tracker. Robots get cold. Elliot, are you cold? Is that a, a thing in this universe? You know what? This is blanketed with mystique. Give me a blanket. Someone give me a blanket. Maybe we can uh, put this on him. Oh yeah, there we go. Well, uh, that, that's not what I wanted to do, but we're doing it anyways. Oh, shortcut, baby. Can you give me your blanket? Can you get naked for me? <laughs> grandma made me this scarf. Isn't it wonderful? She knits so well. Okay, we need to talk to grandma. I had a vague suspicion we needed to talk to grandma. Oh, is that grandma? Okay, everybody needs blankets here. Evidently, it's cold down here. You want something? Gwap? Gwap? Do I want something? I want to know who named you Gwap. That's a very interesting name, Gwap. What's your name? Gwap? Oh, no, it's Cory. It's a little more normal. <laughs> You didn't hear me, Gwap. Oh, that's grandma, all right. I love that there's a grandma in the story. If you bring me some electric cable, I could make you a poncho. So we need to find the right materials. You want me to materialize materials, grandma? I see that. The date stopped at uh, October 11th. Oh, I need electric cable. Okay, we're on the hunt for electric cable. Oh, a memory. Okay, that's definitely not cables, but it's a memory. Rest in peace, humans. Humans were the first residents around here. It seems that they're all dead now. What do you think it feels like being dead? That is a deep question. Let me in, Cosma. Cosma, let me in. Oh, Jesus. Okay, something just 
I, my ears, my brain, my everything. I love that there's little cat toys everywhere. Robot oil. Well, oil be darned. Okay, we can take detergent. I mean, I don't know what that's gonna do, but sure. I mean, I don't think it's detergent for us to use it, but uh, we'll take it anyways. Maybe you have what I'm looking for. You weren't here before. Hi. Joxy. How, how, how he? I'm so sorry. I'm butchering your name. You should go visit the barterman. There's something for everyone over there. The barterman? Where's the barterman? Oh, this looks like maybe it's the barterman. Hello, I'm the merchant of the market. You give me something, I'll give you something in exchange. It's as simple as that. Oh, electric cable. Oh, oh, I have the detergent, buddy. Oh, beautiful. We got it. All right, nice. Oh man, I was looking everywhere for you. All right, let's go to grandma. Let's give her the electric cable. Thank you, my dear. I'll get to work right away. Can I see you work on it? Oh, beautiful. Just for a split second. There you go, little one. It'll suit you well. Grandma, I hope this suits the robot well and not me. You gotta let me in. I have a blanket for your cold friend. Thank you. Let me in. Thanks. See you later. Oh, beautiful. Okay. Look, no tremors. I'm able to work again. Thanks. Now I can definitely fix your tracker. Gained new item. We have the fixed tracker, everyone. We're off. We're off. Okay. Thank you so much, Elliot. Did you manage to fix that tracker? It certainly was me. Didn't uh, require the help of a, a cold robot. Oh, let's see what Seamus is going to do. It's sad that the robots have been here for hundreds of years and it took one little cat to come down here to like fix some really big problems. We got a ping. Is Papa really alive? I can't believe it. Let's follow the tracker. Maybe we'll find where my Papa went. Seamus, I'm coming. Seamus, we're going. Seamus, you're kicking your property. Well, that's an old tin can. I guess it's fine. Oh, Seamus just doesn't give a sh Okay, that's fine. Walking in your footsteps. Yeah, I'm so You don't like the song uh, uh, by police? You're not a police fan? 50 million years ago, you walked a little too slow, Seamus. Keep going. This must be it. He really left the slums. It's dangerous out there, but I must be sure. I need to know. Well, this is a little scary, isn't it, Seamus? A t tiny bit of fear. Okay, it looks bright out there, but it also looks like Zerks. I had the, all the confidence in the world to do that. Hi, don't look at me like that. Look at all these Zerk eggs. They will eat us. I can't do this. You think I can, buddy? I'm not as fast as you. The Zerks will get me for sure. You think I'm fast? That's nice. I, I totally am. Here, take this badge. My papa will recognize it. He will know that you're a friend. I'll open the door for you. You don't have to, Seamus. You actually don't have to. Oh, you're gonna do it anyways. Okay, thanks, Seamus. Uh, wish me luck. Thanks for the badge. Did he close the door? D Seamus, did you- Seamus, why did you- Seamus, why? I mean, I know I'm supposed to just, like, go on ahead. I love the plant life here. Oh, dead end. Wow, what a lovely place, you know? When you, uh, want, uh, tourism, is it definitely the- I'm gonna fall down there. Oh, yeah, I'm falling. Uh, I was saying, if you're interested in tourism, never call your place that. Get me out of here. Ah! Let me up, let me up, let me up. Wow, this is a little bit concerning. Oh my god, Seamus. Seamus, please. Where am I supposed to go? 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 Oh, we made it. We made it? We somehow made it. Getting a little bit more efficient at running away from my life. Wait, from where to where? Okay, okay, okay. Over there? I think from there. There we go. Okay, beautiful. We're, get we're just getting proficient with the controls. I think we are. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Whoa! Jesus Christ! Uh, how are you okay, buddy? Are you okay? That was a huge fall. Doc should be nearby. We must be close. That was terrifying. You play this game because you love cats, but uh, also, ouch. Oh, I think we're okay now. I hear frogs. Okay, so there's like definitely life other than Zerks here. Doc, where are you, buddy? Anybody here other than all these gross creatures? Well, I said I heard frogs. Maybe there aren't frogs. Oh, somebody's got a light on. <gasps> oh, 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 I knew it. We almost missed this place. Dad, I uh, don't want to know about that. I feel the same. Safe zone. Are you sure? I imagine this is Doc's place. Come on. Come on, buddy. Where are you? You got a weird hobby. Just putting those in a cage. Ooh. Oh my god, that's Doc. With those goggles, the design team was like, for sure nobody will mistake it. This is not being Doc. Wait, you're not a Zerk. Who are you? That's my badge you're wearing. How did you find it? Did my son send you? Oh, Seamus, you clever boy. I've been alone here for ages. 
I came here to test my defluxer, but it didn't go as planned. You can have a look around the house if you want, but I have no idea how to escape this place. A remember? Sure. I, what are you going to remember about this, B12? Even with the difficulty they brought, the adults seem to love them very much. Doc says he misses Seamus. Is that the same thing? All right, a memory about children. Deliver your children to the good, good life. Bring them peace and shelter and maybe a future, y'all, but you evidently didn't. Yeah, so we need to uh, help. Uh, Doc get out of here, I think. Uh, Doc is doing what I do. We just like stare aimlessly at things, you know? I think I'm trapped as well. Okay, so the game has trapped us. But evidently, Cat has many brain cells. Aw, oh, that looks like uh, those things where you measure the height. 12 and 12, guys. I see 12 and 12. Am I supposed to remember 12 and 12? Oh, a flashlight. Use that. Oh, it's the defluxer. Hey, be careful with that defluxer. At full charge, it can explode zerks like confetti. This baby needs 1.21 gigawatts to work, and the only thing around here with that kind of juice is the generator outside the house. The problem is that it won't start. I think a fuse blew, and with all the zerks around, it's too dangerous for me to go out and fix it. If you can reach the generator and replace the fuse, I should be able to get the deflexor recharged. Everybody thinks I'm fast. All right, uh, fine. I... <laughs> Speed. Game be like, I'm locking you up in here until you realize what to do, dingus. Here, take this fuse. It's brand new. All right. Thank you. Best of luck. Thanks. Look at him just look at me. Do you know what you sent me off to do, sir? Doc, do you want to document how rude you are? <laughs> <laughs> to where the cables go, right? Uh-huh. So Doc told us that uh, this was going to be loud. I'm not a big fan of that. But you know, here we go. Yep, I'm running. I'm not running. Cutscene. That was mean. All right, Doc. Okay, can you blast the Zerks with that? Hi, Doc. I hope you're gonna help me. Oh, ho, ho, beautiful. <gasps> you wanna help me, buddy? Buddy, you wanna help me? Oh, Okay, there we go. We made it. Thanks, Doc. Oh, yeah, let's go. Best team. Amazing. You got the generator back on. Wait a minute. I might be able to mount this defluxer to your drone. But not the whole thing, right, buddy? Like a piece of it? I can't believe it. We're going to get something to fight the Zerks with. It worked. The defluxer is now installed on your fancy drone there. Okay, so we're going back to the village. Take out all those Zerks so we can get through. Sure. How do we do that? Hold LB to use the defluxer. Oh, buddy. <laughs> Oh, I'm so sorry, B12. So we have to be careful how much we use or else it overheats. All right, let's go, Doc. Let's reunite a family. I'm excited about this. Bringing all the good things to the sad times. This switch doesn't work. It looks like the electricity has been cut. I don't know where we're going. I think we might have to jump on that. Oh, there we go. I see that. There we go. Meow of approval. I love the little meows of approval. Oh, a lever. I know about that, but I also know about those. Saving. Why? I gotta run through someplace, don't I? Oh, get out of my face! Whoa, this is hard. Jesus Christ. I'm prepared for you, dinguses. Where are you? So we have to be calculated about this. Hi, buddies. Okay, we're good. Any more of you in here? No, we have to save Doc, though, for sure. Hi, Doc. Yeah, you run in. See ya later. Whoa. Oh my gosh. I'll go first. Oh... Uh. Cutscene. Oh my gosh, we've brought Doc back home. They're like, who the f Oh, that's Seamus. And the Guardian. Aw. Yo, what? Why is this so sweet? That was lovely. This must really be something. Oh, thank you for that. That made me feel so much better. It's great to see that Seamus is no longer alone. Now we know that we can fight back against the Zerks. Doc and Seamus look happy. I think we did a good thing together. We did. It makes me so happy. All right, you know what, everyone? We're going to end it here for now. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Now catch you in the next one. Probably the last episode of Stray. It's been a really intriguing story. Really wholesome right now. And you know what else is wholesome? Momo. Let's go see Momo. Catch you later, everybody. See you later, Sayonara.